Uh, hey, everybody. Uh, welcome to the Donnie Williams Show. <clears throat> this is the show where I, Todd Anderson, tell a story or uh, give some behind-the-scenes factoids or some general reflections uh, on my career uh, as an actor and uh, acting in general. And I do this at the behest of a musician named Donnie. Now, I wanted to talk about a current event. Uh, there's a lot of current events uh, that are... Uh, taking a lot of the national discourse right now and and and, and various things are, are flying or uh, are, are getting you know uh, lost in the cracks uh of uh you know media reporting um anyway there's this uh, actor uh named uh, uh frank langella uh, and he was fired uh, recently from a, a TV series uh, because he did not stick to the uh, choreography uh, laid out by the uh, intimacy coordinator uh, on the show he was working on. He put his hands in the wrong places on uh, the actress he was working with and she walked out. And then, excuse me, uh, he was fired. Uh, he says he's the victim of cancel culture. Uh, it's ridiculous to uh, do intimacy coordination uh, choreography. Uh, it takes the spontaneity, he says, out of a performance. Um, uh, and he says, you know, it, 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 he, he was uh, fired uh, uh, without uh, uh, anybody calling him. Uh, he was just uh, let go and, and nobody communicated with him. Uh, he had to find out, you know, through his reps. Um, yeah. Um, so here's, here's the thing. I mean, this is what I was thinking, uh, a couple of things, uh, about this. Um, okay. First and foremost, uh, as far as, okay. I have worked on many, many sitcoms, half hour comedy shows, and, uh, some of them are, uh, a very, uh, encouraging about ad-libbing and improvising within scenes. Uh, but other shows are very stringent about not doing that and sticking to the text and not deviating from that. Um, uh, it's like dancing, you know? It, you learn uh, uh, your choreography uh, and you, you can't, you can't, hi Jenny, you can't go all off uh, of, of the choreography because you'll, you know, knock over the other dancers on stage with you. But uh, just because you always make the same steps, you still have to fill it up with an energy that makes it seem spot spontaneous, you know, and when you're uh, working uh, with uh, people who don't allow improv, you uh, also uh, uh, have to fill it up and make it seem like it's improvised and spont spont spontaneous. I mean, that's what acting is. That is it. Um, so if part of the job, even though in the past you've been able to be spontaneous with your makeout scenes, uh, now this new job, you can't be spontaneous. So as an actor, you got to fill that up and make it seem spontaneous and make it feel spontaneous. That's your fucking job as an actor. That's it. Uh, and, uh, and, and as far as, you know, getting, uh, uh, un, you know, unsummarily fired, uh, 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 from that job, uh, and, and being the victim of, of cancel culture, uh, nope. Uh, the cancel culture has nothing to do with this. This is uh, you, Frank Langella, not doing your job. You you you, you had a job to do, uh, and you didn't do it, so you got fired. That's how jobs fucking work. So you weren't doing your job as an actor. You got fired. It happens. Uh, as far as you know, not getting calls uh, from uh, the producers and stuff to talk to you, guess what? When you get fired, that's what happens. Uh, I tested positive uh, for COVID. It was a false positive, but I got fired. Same thing happened to me. Nobody fucking called me. I had to call my reps and say, hey, what's going on? Am I fired? You know, and some people say, no, no, you're not fired. It's not getting fired because you tested. Yes, it is. I tested positive for COVID and I got fucking fired. Now, if that makes me a victim of cancel culture, that's insane. 
Okay? So it's not cancel culture. It's called doing a job and getting it right or your bosses will fire you. It's how fucking jobs work. It's how they work, Frank Langella. I don't know what fucking business you came up in. I've worked myself up. Next week, I'll talk about Fred Savage. <laughs> no, I probably won't. I can't believe that guy uh, got fired for being an asshole. Well, that's a curveball. That's a curveball. This has been a Blursh production. Blursh.